We're going to make these animated captions in DaVinci Resolve 100% free. So I'm here in DaVinci and I'm going to grab a text plus and drop it on my timeline above my background clip. You can change the text font and the color to whatever fits your project. I'm going to go in the shading tab and hit number two here to add a black outline. You can turn up the thickness a little bit, it'll help it pop against different backgrounds. Now to animate it, I'm going to right click my text and open it in the fusion page. Press shift and space on your keyboard and add a transform node. Make sure your playhead is at frame zero on your mini timeline and go ahead and set a keyframe for size. Now go to frame 10 and turn the size up to about 1.2. Add motion blur by hitting settings up here and checking the motion blur box. Now hit shift and space on your keyboard again. We're going to add a soft glow. Go to frame zero and set the gain to about 0.9 and the glow size to about 20. Set keyframes for both. Now go to frame 10 and set the gain at about 1.2 and the glow size to 35. Now press shift and space again. We're going to add a camera shake. Go to frame zero turn the overall strength down to 0.3 and the speed down to 0.3 and set keyframes for both. Go to frame 5 and set overall strength to about 0.9 and speed to 0.5. Then go to frame 10 and set the overall strength back down to 0.3 as well as the speed back down to 0.3. That's all of our keyframing. Now we're going to clean up the animation by clicking spline in the top right. Hit the zoom to fit icon here. Now press Control A or Command A if you're on Mac and go ahead and press S to smooth all of the curves. To make it look even nicer, uncheck everything but transform and drag these lines way out to give it a really nice pop effect. And if you do the same for your gain and your glow size, I think it looks really nice. If you ever need to lengthen or shorten the animation, just hit this time stretch icon, select all of your keyframes, and drag this line to make it longer or shorter. You can drag these templates into your power bins to go ahead and use them across projects. And your final product will be these beautiful animated subtitles. Feel free to customize them. Let me know if you found the video helpful.